Water is at the root of our being, is the essential part of our energetic code woven deep into our layers. Eyes force open spillets, converging into puddles, falling into rivers, following ancient currents out to sea, waiting for those dried up and thirsty to find their way to the river to drink. The return to decolonize is to remember. It is a force to be reckoned with. We came from the womb and never really left it. We are one womb to the next. We are all still children in a big belly that is Earth. C-section into a dimension that corrupts, exploits, extracts, and pollutes. So remember your roots that reach down, spiraling towards the core. Remember the tongue they cut for language was the first to go. They knew understanding came with the bridge, and so they burned that too. Along with the ceremonies and most nostalgically the food, a centerpiece of connection from the bountiful lands we used to sow to the table of our hearts and bellies where we nourish that pull of just how rich life can be to live fully like this. Finding wholeness is hard work and this is a labor of our lineage. So return to decolonize is to remember. It is a force to be reckoned with. Remember your mother tongue. Remember the nourishment that fed you in food and in ritual, in ceremonies and in funerals. Remember the spirit of your culture. Remember the spirit of the land. And even if you have little lineage to trace, because that in itself is a privilege where so much misplaced, erased, detained, killed, adopted, far away, remember, we came from the womb and never left it. We have relatives holding those histories for when our hearts are ready to lift, so create the smell, sing the song, speak the tongue, even if it's broken and scattered. Pick up the pieces. Uncover old currents and come back home. So drink. To decolonize is to remember where our roots quench their thirst too. Tides of creation bursting forth from the first womb. Her waters nourish all life and all vibration. Human struggle, just another reflection in the cutting down of her trees. The extraction of oil from the ground, the garbage and waste of consumerism. We are all just visitors here. And it's time to heal the realities of our tourism. Feel the earth, tend your garden, plant the seeds, even if you don't remember how. If we find our waters in nature, we will find the waters in ourselves. Water is life. Return, drink, remember. To decolonize is more than political practice, intellectual inquiry, cultural correctness. It is deeply spiritual. It is ceremony. It is love. It is a force to be reckoned with.